بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم آئی ایم محمد سیف اللہ فرام اس کے ٹی اکیڈمی ڈاٹ کام ان دس ویڈیو وی ول لرن ہاؤ ٹو میک اے سرکولر اور راؤنڈ کالم وتھ ڈفرنٹ ڈیزائنز ان آٹو کیڈ سو لیٹس ٹرائی سم ڈیزائنز آئی ول ٹیک اے کاپی آف دس کالم اینڈ آئی ول ڈیلیٹ آل دیز لائنز ڈیلیٹ دس لائن and delete these lines now uh, remember my column radius is 9 inches simple I will draw a line here and delete all these lines you can trim it trim it and trim it and delete these lines also delete this line you may apply a boundary or a region I will apply region or easy for region select all these lines and press enter now I will apply a revolve option or EV for revolve select this object press enter and this will be my access point so this design will revolve on this axis this will be my end point of this axis and I want an angle of 360 so I will switch to one of the isometric view and you can see very simple to design a 3D column now I will take a copy of it take another copy now I will apply 3D rotate 3 or for 3D rotate select your base point click here click here and go downwards and click now I will create a circle click here and offset of 0.5 inches to inside and to outside now I will draw a circle again and I will array it AR for array I want polar array select object press center and this will be my center point and I want total number of 28 you also may try to 30 or 27 preview it it's okay Except now I will extrude all these circle to this point so my length will be 9 feet 11 inches try distance first 9 feet 11 inches now I will extrude all these circles ext for extrude and uh, try window selection extrude 9 feet 11 inches now you can see I will apply union uni for union select all these objects and press enter this is how it works now delete this one copy I will apply a different shape again another design now uh, we have in a toolbar modeling uh, right click uh, here I turned on modeling toolbar and here we have an option of helix so H E L A I X for helix and you can specify a base point this will be my base point base radius will be 5 inches so I will enter 5 inches top radius will be 5 inches again and uh, 
I want turns to be 5 you also may try 3 4 6 etc and my height will be 9 feet 11 inches this is our helix now draw a circle here and I will sweep along this path so we have an option sweep select circle press enter and select this helix so this is how you can design amazing circular columns now for the base again to 2d wireframe take an offset of 4 inches and offset of 2 inches extrude this 2 inches extrude this 2 inches and move this one upwards and give it a distance of 2 inches now move the, circle, uh, the column uh, 4 inches click here and uh, your direction will be on z axis and give it a distance of 4 inches this will be our base now you also can apply a different base I'll take a copy sorry F for fillet R for radius give it a radius of 2 click here press enter and enter again again F for fillet click here press enter and enter again so different bases different column designs you can also try more designs if you want so that's it for this tutorial I hope you will enjoy watching my tutorials if you like my video do subscribe my channel like it and share it share it and also must comment on it see you in next videos bye